besties come spend the day with us besties come spend the day with us we are starting our day off at a museum today the bell county museum it is so pretty from the outside here if you have never been to belton texas their downtown historic area it is gorgeous that's where our little texas traveling took us today me and the babies are all here super excited to go inside and see what they have so let's go we have a few places to go after this but this is our first stop for today so come on come with me let's go inside and see what we think the kids have been so excited about going they could barely sleep last night i love that they love museums and art they have this gorgeous vietnam war art display at the museum i think the museum director said that it was going to be here till january so it's really cool that we got to see it now let's go see what else they have they just told us that there is a log cabin display, so we're going to go check that out after we finish looking at the artwork here. I absolutely love art museums. While I love any type of museum, my favorite is probably art museums. Has anyone else been to the Smithsonian? There are so many different museums and it's so gorgeous. Here's the little log cabin. I can't wait to visit New York next year so I can see all the different museums. In particular, I want to see some displays by Jean-Michael Bisquet and also Andy Warhol. I want to go to the Brooklyn Museum of Art and the Met. I also really love like fashion art museums. I think that those are gorgeous. Okay, now we are in the room that has like some fossils and also like arrowheads and stuff about Native Americans of Texas. A little fun fact, my kids are both enrolled tribal members of the Ogallala Lakota Sioux tribe. Okay, we are going in a different area now. Let's go. There's so many different rooms here. This is more just the history of the area, I believe. Let's see what they have in here. I love learning. Like history has always been my favorite subject. I just love knowing about the past. And I also love like learning about different cultures and different places and just learning about different people, different ways of life. These teacups are so gorgeous. And this is also a really pretty painting over here here is about like isn't this so gorgeous like so pretty a little bit of antiques and fashion from different time periods okay let's see what else they have an old typewriter this is so much fun it is so nice in here too have some old like army uniforms that you can try on which my kids love. There's a lot of interactive things here for the kids. And also they have like a lot, I was reading online, they have like a lot of like events they host. So if you live in the area or within driving distance, it's definitely something to check out. They have a lot of things for kids. Oh look, these are little models of like different things in the town and also like different houses. I was reading that some of these houses that you can still view, like they're still standing. But the original price for the house was like $4,000. I believe this one is the one that's so crazy. Can you imagine? <laughs> if you could go back in time, you need to buy property. That's, <laughs> that's what you need to do. Okay, we are leaving the museum now and we're going to go get something to eat. So come along with us. From Belton, we went to Temple. This is one of my favorite restaurants in Temple. Mexicano Grill number two. Look at this Frida mural, it's so gorgeous. Like the artwork in this restaurant is so gorgeous and the food is so good. I ordered for myself the Azteca fajitas. It has like mushrooms, green peppers, onions, cheese, steak and chicken and it's delicious. The rice isn't that great. To me, my daughter loves it, but I okay but everything else is so good okay we left there now we're off to the park i'd never been to this park before so i did not know that they have like a little splash pad here so my kids are about to be in the water splashing and having living their best lives in like clothes their regular clothes but that's okay i think maybe we'll come back tomorrow with their swimsuits on but this little park is so cute like this is so awesome that they have this Every park in Texas should have a splash pad because it is so hot here. Like cities need to build more of these that are free to every place because this is amazing and it is just so hot outside. Like I want to play in there myself. Instead, I'm watching them sitting in the sun. You know what I mean? But that's our day. Thank you for coming along with us and spending the day with us.